Hey guys, I am Pixel Dan, and this is a review of the Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom Mosasaurus from Mattel. The Mosasaurus is another one of the really big dinos that Mattel is releasing that I got really excited about when I saw it back at New York Toy Fair. And now it's hitting store shelves with all of the other dinos, so we are going to check it out. Now this guy does come in a packaging where he's mostly enclosed except for his head and some spots where you could feel his real like skin as the box calls it. It might look like he doesn't quite fit in there or almost like he's a hand puppet, but that's because there is some minor assembly required when you pull this guy outside of the package. You're gonna have to assemble all four fins and his tail in order to get him fully complete. Now there's a little sheet of instructions that are gonna guide you through assembling the fins and it's very important to follow those instructions because the two big fins go on the front, the two small ones on the back, and of course, you need to make sure they're matched up on left and right. It's really uh, well labeled because each of them has a letter and the instructions tell you exactly where to put them. You have to make sure you put those on right because once you clip those on, they're not gonna come off. They are not meant to be removed, so definitely follow those instructions. It's actually very simple to follow those, real easy to put them together, and once you do, this right here is what you get. Check this out, this massive, Mosasaurus toy. Now, if I were to bring in the tape measure here, you would see that from the nose to the tail, this guy measures about 27 inches long. So he is over two feet long. And if we measure from the bottom, uh, let's say all the way up to the tip of the tail, he's right at 12 inches or one foot tall. So over two feet long, about one foot tall from the floor to the tip of the tail, which is the, the tallest point on this thing. This is a pretty massive dinosaur toy. And I've got the four inch uh, Owen figure standing here next to him. Uh, I don't know if you can really see him very well there, but that gives you a good scale difference of the Mosasaurus with the human-like characters. Now, I think this would still be much, much bigger in real life, uh, the way he was depicted in the first Jurassic World movie, but come on, man, this is still really great. This still makes for a huge, huge toy. I mean, just look at this thing. Look at this. I feel like I captured a giant fish or an alligator or something while I'm holding this. He's amazing. So one of the things about the Mosasaurus, uh, the box kind of talks about he's got like the real feel skin or whatever. They made him squishy. So he's soft in the body here. Uh, so you can, he's just hollow inside and he's very soft, but I guess that's just to add to the overall feel, kind of give him that more reptilian feel since he's like a, a water uh, dino there. Uh, but he's still really nicely sculpted. You can see very, very nice sculpt. I love the nose there and the teeth and the eyes, very cool look with the colors there. The fins are all posable. So I can kind of, you can see I got those like ball-like hinge joints on all the fins. So the fins can come outwards just like this. They can move up, they can move down. So you can pose all the fins. The tail itself just kind of locks in place. So you won't be able to swivel the tail, but you can open and close the mouth. Oh! Uh, unfortunately, no eating feature like with the Colossal T-Rex, so he can't swallow anybody. But I mean, he still is big enough that like, you know, let's get Dr. Grant here. Can just like, look, he's like the whole length of the mouth. Oh, nom, nom, nom. Oh, oh, Dr. Grant, no. I never knew you would meet your doom with a Mosasaurus. <laughs> It's just a really fun dinosaur toy. I love the Mosasaurus. I think he's a cool dino. He's just very neat looking. It's one of those ones we don't really see a lot in toy form. And I think that's one of the things that got me so excited about this. He's just a really big, really fun dino that I think kids could have a lot of fun playing with, but also looks really great up on a shelf if you're a dinosaur collector or just wanna add him to your figure shelf as well. So if you wanna see this guy alongside some of the other Jurassic World dinos, this is what he looks like. You can see he is one of the biggest ones. Of course, that colossal T-Rex is gonna win that battle, but still, he's a very big dino in this line and definitely a very fun one to add to the collection. So these guys are hitting store shelves right now. I specifically found this one at Walmart at the same time I found my Colossal Tyrannosaurus Rex, so definitely check there. He is worth picking up if you're a dinosaur fan or a collector of these new Jurassic World toys from Mattel. So happy hunting, my friends. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please hit the like button, leave me a comment, let me know what you think, and don't forget to subscribe. Until next time, my friends.